Incantimals, Leora Lion and the Lost Kingdom, at the end of the story, three surprise questions await you. Please subscribe, like and share the video. Thanks, Leora Lion, the courageous and kind-hearted protector of her enchanted forest, woke up one morning with a sense of excitement. Her animal companion, Quick Paw, a speedy little cub, felt it too. As they roamed through the forest, they discovered an old, weathered map tucked inside the hollow of an ancient tree. The map was covered in symbols, and at its heart, it showed a path leading to the Lost Kingdom, a place forgotten by time and mystery. Intrigued, Leora gently placed the map in her satchel and smiled at Quick Paw. We have a new adventure ahead of us, she whispered. They set off toward the path, venturing deep into the unknown parts of the forest. The trees grew taller, their leaves thick with ancient magic, and the air felt charged with excitement. As they journeyed, the forest grew darker, and strange creatures appeared, glowing insects and colorful birds Leora had never seen before. They chirped happily at the duo, guiding them along the path. After hours of travel, they found themselves at the foot of a grand archway made of entwined vines and golden stones. Beyond it, they glimpsed the lost kingdom, shimmering towers, overgrown gardens, and a castle carved into a mountainside. Leora stepped forward, but something felt off. The kingdom, though beautiful, seemed eerily quiet. Quick Paw crouched low, sensing the same. As they entered, they discovered statues of animals frozen in mid-movement. It's as if time stopped here, Leora whispered, her voice echoing in the still air. Suddenly, a soft, glowing figure appeared in front of them, an ancient lion spirit. You have found the lost kingdom, it said in a deep, gentle voice. But it has been cursed for many generations. Only one with a pure heart and the courage to restore balance can awaken it once more. Determined, Leora stepped forward. I will do whatever it takes to lift this curse, she said confidently. The lion spirit nodded, then faded into the air, leaving a trail of sparkling dust. Leora knew her quest had only just begun, questions, what do you think the curse on the lost kingdom might be, and how could Leora possibly break it, why do you think Leora was chosen by the ancient lion spirit to save the kingdom, if you were Leora, how would you feel walking into a forgotten, silent kingdom full of frozen statues, 